you may know, Maria decided to run um, officially a little bit over six months ago. And the reason she did that is because she's invested in this community. She's a part of it, she believes in it, and more, more than anything, she believes in all of you. Um, she's a first generation college student like me. And she didn't just use her education to go make a lot of money, she poured back into the community. Um, out today, uh, passing out some information, we've got two important events coming up on Saturday. I think when people look at Maria, they may think, oh, she's a part of this new wave of folks who are women, people of color trying to run for office. But this isn't about identity politics. She is the most qualified candidate for this board. What gets me going every morning, what keeps me doing all these events on the campaign and, and doing the work that I do professionally and socially is the fact that I think we're winning. I see more people stepping up every day and it's amazing and it's inspiring and I want to do that too. Hey, this is Maria Hatton here. At the end of the day, we need leaders and elected officials who will go into those city hall chambers and who will tell the whole story about the city of Chicago. We deserve better. We deserve people who care about us, who will listen to us, um, and who can understand what our problems are. And if someone's been in office for so long that they can't relate, that they can't return a phone call, or that they don't understand, that even though it's not something that touches or impacts them directly, like it could be life or death for somebody else in their community, um, then they need to go. If a kid on the south side of Chicago can't read, that matters to her, even if that isn't her kid. If a, a senior citizen is having their rights violated in the west side of Chicago, that matters to Maria, even if that isn't her grandparent. And that's why she is the best candidate for this ward. I can listen to people, and we can make decisions together. And it's as simple as that, right? I've done it in a dozen cities. It happens here all the time in very organic ways. And so I want to make sure that we're making decisions together, not just about how to spend a million dollars, but about what the future of this community looks like. She knows the community, she knows the issues, and she's ready to lead. And I want to introduce candidate Maria Hatton.